What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the America Truck Simulator Let's Play. And as you guys can see, man, we got our truck here, chilling, chilling. We gotta find us a load to go ahead and take care of, really quick. So let's see what we can do, man. We at the freight market, guy. We're in Kingman, so we gotta find a load leaving Kingman. Let's see if I can find something. I kind of want to go into the New Mexico area. We still ain't did that. We ain't been to New Mexico yet. So I want to find. Or at least something going closer towards that area because I know these trips are going to be long as hell. So if we can find one like Holbrook or Kenyatta or something like that, those would be some good trips. We haven't been to Sierra Vista and this load is going down there. 400 mile trip though. I don't think I want to deal with a 400 mile trip. It is one going to Holbrook right here. And it's actually exactly where we're at. We're going to be able to pick up this load like right now. We got these are LA trips, no gals. Okay, so I guess we're going to Holbrook and uh, we'll just get another load from Holbrook and we'll go into New Mexico then. So I guess in our next episode will be in uh we'll be in New Mexico then. But we're already at our destination. I just gotta go and select the load. So let's go ahead and do that. So this is the load that I, no, that is not the load that I selected, but we could change it. Let's go into show low, going down here. That actually wouldn't be a bad load, 11,000. Oh, the load we picked is a $21,000 load though. Definitely will get more money. 292 miles, 284 miles. Yeah, this is definitely worth it. So we're gonna go ahead and take that. And there's our load right there. So let me pull up. I'm about to just back right into that load. I ain't even finna turn around or nothing. I'm finna back right into it. Alright, after after I'm, I'm trying to see man, I was actually gonna take today off and I wasn't gonna record anything today, but I said bump it man, let's go to get a little bit more work done. Hey get a little bit more work done, man. If I if I'm feeling like recording just a little bit, I'm gonna record. All right, so there we go. I don't even know what load this actually is. Like, what are we actually carrying? Heavy duty braided cable, okay. It doesn't even look, okay, never mind. It does look braided. It does look braided, never mind. I was about to say, what kind of braided cable is this? It ain't even braided. All right, we would have to make a immediate right after this, man. Come on. All right, okay, all right. All right, you know what? I think in this episode I may do a little bit of story time. Oh no, I don't really, I don't really do too many story times. I don't do story time at all, actually. Should I say? Cause you know what I'm saying, man. I don't, I don't really, I don't really think my stories are too interesting. Mainly because I don't know. It's just me. Like I, I it takes a lot to entertain me, or it takes a lot to interest me. So if I'm interested in something. Or, you know, like if I if I find something interesting or think something's interesting, then, you know, that's a lot. And usually most of the stories that I have, they might not be interesting to me, but a lot of you guys might want to hear them. Because a lot, well, actually, a lot of you guys have been telling me to go ahead and do some story time. So I guess I could do a little bit of story time. So this time we're going to do, um, I could talk about this this one party where I went to. It, it wasn't even really, it wasn't really uh, uh, like nothing too spectacular. I remember I just got wasted like fuck. Me and a couple of friends, but we, we was in that party. We got fucked up, man. I even have a video from that party where I was just I was just drunk as shit, saying some awkward ass shit. I may actually throw that into this video if I remember. I'll edit it in and I'll let you guys see what that see what I was talking about. But to start off the story, man, it, it all happened. This is like I think two years ago. This is on I think it was just a random party. I don't even think it was anybody like anybody that I knew. I don't think it was any of their birthdays or anything. Cause usually whenever it's one of my friends' birthdays, we always get fucked up on their birthdays. So I, I don't think this was anybody's birthday. We just got like invited to some party or something like that. They were just saying, come if you wanna come. So shit. You know what I'm saying? We we got up, we went and we went. It was me, it was me, Jet, and like my boy Dante. And another friend named Bird, that's actually his nickname. His name is not actually Bird, so yeah. But yeah, we all went to this party. And, and when we got there, the party was hella, hella dry. We, we we thought it was dead. Like, we was like, damn, we just came to this damn party. And it's like, ain't shit happening. Ain't nothing going on. Like, there, there wasn't nothing to smoke. There wasn't nothing to drink. It was just like, we were there. there 
music wasn't even playing like that. I don't think it was low as hell. I think, like it was just, it, it was it was it was weird. It was weird, man. It was weird. So whenever when we went, we was just standing around, looking around, walking, and like we was at somebody's house. Now their house is decently big. So you, when we were in their house, we was like, but there's barely anybody here yet. And we were thinking we were just too early. We probably should have waited. Mind you, it's like ten thirty. It's like, it's like 10, 30, 11 o'clock when we got there. So we like, hold up, bro. Something not right, man. Something not right. So we, we just we just sit on the couch. We waiting. And then there's like a couple girls come in the room. They like, oh, yo, yo, the, the, the party, um, the party in, I forgot, uh, um, I forgot what they call them shits. But she's like, the, um, she's like, the, the drinks and stuff haven't came yet. So, you know, we're just waiting on the drinks and stuff to come. And oh, we're like, oh, okay, okay. So that's what we're waiting on. So we just sitting up there, we waiting, we waiting. About uh, I'd say about a good thirty minutes, thirty minutes to forty five minutes later, some drinks and stuff. Came. Well, I say thirty minutes later because it was kind of quick. We wasn't really waiting too long. So I say about thirty minutes later, the drinks come. So we was like, oh okay, okay. So we got we got some liquor now, and it was a lot of liquor. Like they they went sick. They they got bottles on bottles on bottles on bottles, and I was just like, oh shit. These folks really wildin' right now, bro. So when they did that, I was just like, okay, all right. So they got the they got hella bottles and stuff. We 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 finna get lit. We finna get you know what I'm saying. So first first off, they they passing out cups and stuff. They give everybody a cup. You know what I'm saying. They fill it up. I'd say about a third of the way, something like that. About a, yeah, about a third of the way. And, and you know we we just sitting up there. We drinking. You know we doing we we doing we drinking and shit. We sipping. Everybody getting a little bit more loose, you know. It, it's starting to get a little bit turned in the party. Like they start turning on music that, to where you know the females can start twerking and dancing and shit. Cause it was, it was, it wasn't that many people there, but it was a decent amount of people there to where we could have some type of fun. It was at least, I say at least about fifteen people there. At least fifteen, twenty people. It was a small party. It wasn't nothing huge. So, but we went up in that joint, man. Everybody, everybody up in there. Everybody getting drunk. Everybody drinking and shit. So we was like, all right, all right, yo, everybody getting loose. You know, it's about to get lit. They turn on some music. Next thing you know, we got some girls start dancing. Everybody still sitting down and stuff, though. Like all the dudes still sitting down. The girls get up, start dancing and shit, cause the liquor done hit their system and shit. So we was like, okay, okay, bet, boy, bet. We just sitting up there. You know, we, you know, all the dudes, we waiting on the liquor to hit us. That man, bruh. The liquor didn't even really hit me. It didn't even hit me yet. I had, I, I basically had, I want to say about, um, I'd say in the first cup that I had, I want to say it was maybe about, uh, I want to say it was maybe about probably two, maybe three shots. Two, maybe three shots. So I had drunk all that. When it got some more, now when I get, when I went and got some more, I, I was sipping that a lot slower than I was the first, uh, the first cup. Cause, I didn't want I didn't want my um like I didn't want to down stuff too quick, so I just I just stopped. You know what I'm saying? I started going slow, started drinking slow. Then it started to hit me a little. Well, actually, it didn't even really hit me too hard until the gas got in. I when the gas got in, we went outside, rolled up like two blunts, started smoking. So it was like I say the first blunt gone. We on the second blunt. That's when it hit me, boy. I was I was super faded, like. Ooh, that, that when it hit me. I, I was crossfaded like a mug, bruh. When I mean after that, it, it was history. Like I'm, I'm surprised I even still remember this much of the, this much of the uh, actual, actual party. Cause it was, it was just like everything. It, after that, it was just fun as hell. Once everybody had some weed and some damn some liquor in their system, bruh. When I mean that party became hella lit, bruh. Like everybody was getting dances, bruh. I'm, I'm sitting, bruh. You sitting up there going back and forth, just jumping from. Bruh, just just sitting up there. Everybody, it's like a couple people in that party. They found themselves like uh, like everybody, like girls was dancing on most of the niggas. And how it was was like the the female would slick choose you, and she would dance on you the whole night. Like it was just you know like one girl would dance on one dude the entire night type thing. It was it was I think it was like two girls that was dancing on more than one dude though. But it was like I think they only danced on like two or two two or three dudes, something like that. But that, 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 yeah, that, that's how it was going. So, you know, everybody was getting their dances from the single person, man. I ain't even going to count. I remember when I was getting my dances, bro, I was just sitting up there with my cup in my hand. And, and like, while she was sitting up there just straight twerking on my balls, but I was like, I was like, sip, sip, boy, sip, sip. I was just sitting up there just getting drunker and drunker, bro. When I'm, like, I, I say, we're, we're probably, I'd say about a good hour after the liquor got there. 
I had took equivalent to maybe six or seven, probably eight shots, bro. So I'm fucked up. Like, I'm all the way fucked up. Done smoked like three, four more blunts. So, you know what I'm saying? We we really, we really up through that. You know what I'm saying? We really up through that. Next thing you know, it, it just get real turn. Like, everybody is up. Everybody, and I mean everybody. was nobody sitting on the couches or nothing. Everybody is up dancing, doing what they do. Like, it, it just became way more way more fun like way more so i was like i was like damn all right so this shit right here this shit getting lit this shit really getting lit so hold up man i actually got oh shit oh shit god damn it oh man i just got a notification saying gonna drop the new tape but uh he dropped a new album and i won't be able to listen to it yet and then i got another notification from somebody they're trying to call me on discord i gotta tell them hold up let me finish but yeah man um it's like bro it's like when all that when all that happened i was just like like damn but this party really just got lit as fuck like what what's really what's really going on right now bro like everybody getting dances and then like the the video i was telling you guys about i'm gonna go ahead and probably put it up right about now but if i remember hopefully i remember but um when that happened when that right there happened bruh i was so fucking faded you could tell the video was old because my dreads was hella short you know what i'm saying they was three short like man bro I, I don't even know what was going on with me and that and that shit but i was just i was a uh, through that you know what i'm saying man i was a uh, through that bro that was just a good ass time and it's like uh after everything like happened we we all you know we still we still getting turned i'd say it's maybe 12 30 1 o'clock you know it was just a short small party they wasn't really trying to keep it long so once like i once like about 12 1 o'clock hit they was like all right time to go ahead and disband everybody can go ahead and slide on out you know what i'm saying so everybody getting up getting ready everybody dipping and shit now the person that was driving us home, of course he didn't drink, but everybody else in the car with this man was drunk, bruh. I, what I mean, bruh, he was definitely the goddamn, the driver for the night, bruh, because everybody, and I mean everybody else in that car was drunk, bruh. I remember I was sitting in the car and I was just leaning forward like, what the fuck did I do? Oh my God. Did I really just do, did I really just do this to myself? Did I really just set myself up? So I was like, all right, all right, cool, cool, man. We're just going to have to... We just gonna have to um we just gonna have to keep them moving and you know what i'm saying i'm hopefully hopefully nothing happens hopefully nothing happens so i'm sitting up there i'm, I'm sitting up there goddamn drunk as ever in the car the car bro it's like it, if you've ever been drunk and then riding in the car bro it, it's like it's like bro you you just you be moving like when the car moves it's like it just shakes the liquor in your body and you just get even more drunk even more drunk it's like what the well, it, it is like it really fucks up your stomach too you feel like you gotta throw up real bad and i knew i drunk too much that night because boy when i got in that car i kid you not bruh it's like my boy took like four five turns but and i felt like i was about to up chuck everything but so it's like man i held it all we we got dropped off I, I think we got we got dropped off at my boy dante house that was me and jamal me yeah me and jack and Dante, we got dropped off at Dante's house, and me and Jet ended up spending the night there. I remember we could have went home. I don't know why we didn't go home, but we ended up spending the night there. So, and we had like I think we had like two more blunts or something like that. Like we had enough weed for two more blunts. So Jamal was like, "Fuck it, I'm finna, I'm finna go ahead and roll up again." So while Jamal rolling up, my my stomach just get worse and worse and worse and worse, and I'm just like, "Oh my god, what is going on?" what is going on oh, and it's just getting worse and worse so i'm like all right all right fuck I'm, I'm i can't i can't i can't do this man i can't do this so i go to the side of the house and i just lean over and i'm like fuck it i'm about to just throw up Ugh. sitting up there throwing up i say when i i say almost a little bit a little bit after i had started throwing up i heard them fire up the blunt so i'm like damn i'm about to miss the fucking blunt I'm literally back there throwing up the entire time the blunt was being smoked, bruh. So I'm like, man, they, you know, it, it kind of wouldn't even matter. I don't think they wanted to got down. You know what I'm saying? I don't think it was a good idea for me to get on the blunt anyway after all that. So, man, so they fin they ended up finishing that blunt and got down. It's like after that, I was just like, bruh, I'm good. I feel, I like, I ain't even gonna cap. I, st I started to feel a little bit better after I threw up. I started to feel a little bit better because I, I drunk too much. 
in that night. Like I was, I was getting too lit in that night. It drunk too much. But man, it's like that. That party was too damn fun, man. That party was too damn fun. And then, man, oh, I will say this. Now I don't know if this, you know, actually, I'll, I'll say it anyway. I don't care. Uh, like my boy Jet, he was, uh, he was, he was getting his dance from this one girl. I think it was the host of the party. And she actually had a boyfriend, so he just kept he kept getting dances from her, but he didn't know she had a boyfriend. So goddamn, he just getting dance at the dance at the dance, and then like I remember, um, like they sat down, and I think I think she had like she kissed my boy Jamal. I didn't I didn't even see it. Jamal actually ended up telling me this like after the part like the next day he ended up telling me this. He was like he was like he he just he just kissed like she kissed him, and, and then like she stopped. And then like the, the the girl boyfriend walked up on him and just flashed a strap at him and i, I was like I, I didn't even know about all this but that man jet was like he was like damn i ain't even, i ain't even know she had a boyfriend or nothing like that it's like what the fuck? so that shit crazy bro that shit really shows bro that that man look at have a bitch cheating bro <laughs> look at have a bitch cheating bro i don't like that shit, bro that shit crazy man that shit there is crazy. I'm trying to tell you, bruh. That shit right there is crazy. But shit, man. That 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 was that was a fun ass night, bruh. That was a fun ass night. Like I, I really wanna start doing more parties and stuff. Like I, I wanna start going to a lot more parties and starting to do more stuff like that, but you know, it, it's like we really don't be hearing about parties like that no more. Like we we don't we don't hear shit. So you know what I'm saying? It's like damn. But hey man, apparently there's supposed to be a bunch of new, uh, new different things that we're gonna be able to do. And th I, this is why I really need to start vlogging because if we was vlogging that, that shit would have been funny. That shit would have been so damn funny. This is really why I want to start vlogging and shit. So I will be like branching off and you know, like I did say, I was supposed to do that. Uh, like I was supposed to do a channel like that where we was gonna be doing challenges and shit like that. So I will definitely still be doing that. I just haven't gotten around to, you know, getting around to doing all that just yet. But I will, we will be doing it. We will be doing it. Ain't no if, fans or buts about that. We will be doing it. So man, I'm trying to tell you that was a that was a fun ass night, man. That was a fun ass night. It's like we just had everything kind of planned out. We had a we had a designated driver. We had got down a good ass time. We had everything we needed. You know, nothing got lost. Nobody got hurt. You know, nothing. Basically, the night was just perfect, bruh. Like the night was just the night was just like a perfect party night. It was it was the way it was the way a party night should go whenever you have a party man like you know nothing goes wrong everything is fine and peachy you know what i'm saying and and, and that's it it was just it was just a good ass night it was just a good ass night man so you know what i'm saying i, I really enjoyed that night it was it was fun hold on i'm actually i'm actually responding to a text real quick I gotta see, okay, there we go. but yeah man that that was definitely like uh that was one of the nights that really made me want to uh like really made me want to start like getting into more parties and stuff the only thing is that parties and stuff and if, if you don't live in georgia you don't know man you go to if you go to a kickback or some shit like that you go to a party that's a little too big man dudes out dudes around here love to shoot for some reason man they love to shoot up parties i don't know why it's like uh it's like a party it's like a a, a party could be like nobody in the party like nobody who hosts the party should i say would have beef with anybody you know what i'm saying it'll be a it'll be a regular cool party and then out of nowhere i said an hour into the party you're hearing 30 40 shots go off it's like what the fuck just happened like bruh like i'm like when i was staying with my dad i went to i this one time that was the first it was the first party i ever went to like i knew parties got shot up and this was when i was a junior i was no i think it was a junior was i a junior I think I was a junior in high school at the time and I was visiting my dad's house. I wasn't even living with him at the time. I was visiting my dad's house. And my stepbrother was like, shit, there's a party going down, you trying to go? I was like, uh shit, this is the first party I ever I ever decided to go to. So I was like, fuck it. I'm alright, I go. So I went. We at the party, bruh. We only there for probably about a good hour and a half, bruh. Next thing you know, Bah, 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 bah. Like what the fuck, bro? Like damn, my first party got shot up, bro. The first party I went to got shot up, and then when I got home, it later found out that um, 
Later found out that somebody at the party got shot in the face. So it's like, damn, bro, what the fuck? That make that dead ass makes you not want to go to parties and shit, bro. Cause it's like you you might you might get hit with a straight bullet all because somebody else is just careless as hell at a fucking party, bro. It's like since when do you bring guns to a fucking party, bro? It's like damn, that shit don't make no sense, bro. But hey, man. Uh, yeah, I'm skipping this, but it's just how it, I guess that's just how that, them shits went. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy it. If you guys did, make sure you guys drop a like down below, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. If you guys want to hear more story times, let me know in the comment section down below because uh, I'll definitely more than likely get some more story times done for you guys. We'll go ahead and do um, Fragile Cargo. But yeah, man, hopefully you guys did enjoy. I will catch you guys in the next episode or last year, man. Peace on out.